All right, so here's an example of just shit television programming. I, I uh, recorded the newest episode of the Purge TV series that's been going on, and this is a shit that's on like a couple minutes. It starts recording beforehand, and this is fucking hilarious. That he won't be tempted, that he respects our relationship. That clip seems to show <laughs> that he's not doing what he said he would do. No, he's supposed to be proving that he's all in on our relationship. That it's me and no one else. That's not respect. That's not respect at all. <laughs> okay, so tell me this. You're going to go on a fucking show, but the whole point of it is to try to... to I mean, I'm, I, I will bet my life says all this shit's bullshit anyways. This fucking dumb hoe and this dude, they whoever the fucking guy is, I'm sure they're probably fucking married or dating. It's just fucking drama made up fucking shit. But even if these people really were in a relationship, I mean, look at the fucking name of the show. They go on a show and they go, he was supposed to prove that he loves me. Well, you're a dumb slut. Why would he love you? You're on a fucking TV show. But the whole point is to be tempted to cheat on somebody. You deserve to be cheated on. Fucking stupid ass shit. This is why I stick to older shows. Except for The Purge. Kind of like The Purge. I think we might actually need to have our own yearly purge around here. I would most definitely participate in it. Um, But yeah, outside of that, I'm trying to think of what the other show is. Uh, I kept, I did start watching The Mayans Season 2 because I watched the first one, the Sons of Anarchy spinoff. And uh, fucking like, they're like six or seven episodes in, and there's already like, they said one more episode before the finale. What the fuck is that, man? I don't know if, I can't remember if the first season was short or not, too, but it's like, dude, Sons of Anarchy seemed like it would go on like the entire football season. Just kept going and going and going every season. But, damn, man, if they're going to sit and like chop it off like that, I'll just wait till the show's done and watch it like that. But this kind of shit right here is exactly what I'm talking about. This shit makes me want to fucking vomit, dude. It's stupid. I mean, but the problem is, is that you know as well as I do that people watch this garbage, and that's why the fuck they keep putting this stupid shit on TV. That's it. I mean, does it, like, make people feel better about their fucking shitty lives watching somebody else pretend to be like they're all upset about something? Or, uh, I don't know. I just don't get it. Like, these other fucking... I don't know. It just pisses me off. It's stupid. This shit right here is stupid. And you know what? I hope that chick is dating some guy. And I hope he fucking cheats on her. Because fuck her. And fuck him too. Both of them for being a stupid ass show. I hope she gets fucking screwed by somebody too. Fucking ignorant ass shit. Sorry. Had a fucking long ride home. And uh, Bob got into it with a couple people on the fucking road. So just uh talking crazy but i'm like i, I start this I, I go to hit play on this episode and this is what i see is this bitch crying and i'm like oh my god dude oh my god bitch that is not respect you're on a fucking show shown nationwide about trying to purposely tempt the person you're with to cheat on you i mean i'm guessing that's what it is i can't say for certain but uh from the fucking commercials i've seen during the, the purge episodes that's what it seems like. Like, wow, man. You want to be respected. <laughs> really, dude? Anyhow, later, y'all.